Hello guys, this is Thomas from Finite and welcome back to another recap. And today was uh, a slightly uh, losing day for me. And to be honest, I kind of messed up because my play was in uh, Peloton and seeing as it was gapping over uh, yesterday's spin bar, it was a really nice long setup um it was kind of hard to find some tradable stocks today because most of them were extended and um you know possibly uh there were some short plays but uh the market is still very strong and so the peloton was one of uh, really nice setups that I have prepared for today and so sure enough from the open it uh, was going up nicely uh, I couldn't find a, a good entry up until this point uh, right after uh, 10 a.m. where I decided to place my order uh, above 46.20 so I got about two or three cents slippage and then, and then immediately it reversed and took my stop loss just below 35.80. Now, what is the takeaway from my trading here? The takeaway is if you fail once, uh, but the stock is still presenting the uh, the setup that you wanted to take. You should always keep it, uh, keep monitoring it, and keep trading it. And so, I'm not saying that I should have taken this low, although it was somewhat of a buy setup. Uh, but let's focus on a more uh, on uh, uh, later entries. And you can see that the break of 47 whole number was a really nice uh, setup with a relatively small stop loss of 20 cents. It was the break of the whole number. Sure. A uh, slight concern would have been those highs, couple couple of cents higher, uh, but at that point, I believe the S and P was already trading uh, upwards, and the risk to reward was just fantastic. So, at forty seven forty, that would have been the two to one, and it went uh, all the way to three to one. Uh, given a couple of cents slippage, of course, you would aim for somewhere around 47.45, I believe. And so that was actually my mistake of uh, not keeping an eye on, on this particular stock throughout the day. And I could, uh, I instead of being minus 1%, I could have been plus 1%. And that is a 2% difference and uh, so that is really something that uh, I messed up today. So uh, really a, just a quick, quick recap today. Uh, don't give up on your setups. Eventually you can see the daily look just beautiful. Uh, and actually with the strong market support and a pin bar, uh, this was really a no-brainer. So the only thing that got me was this uh, deeper pullback here. And of course, being mad at the market is uh, plain nonsense. You can only be mad at yourself. And if there was no re-entry point, no re-entry pattern, uh, I would have been uh, so mad, but with this really nice formation up there at 47, uh, there is really no excuse uh, that I can 
uh, with that, with what I can justify not taking this trade. So uh, I hope you guys can learn from my today's mistake and uh, don't give up on the stocks that you had losers in. So thanks guys and see you in tomorrow's recap.